Baby, you ready? What's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to another video. And in today's video, um, we're guys are meeting somebody uh, that's, you know, going to be on this channel from here on out. They just got their first sports car. And uh, you guys are going to be seeing them on the channel, so we might as well introduce that one person. And that is... I... <laughs> <laughs> That's my wifey. So um, she, I don't, I really didn't know how to bring her into the videos, and she really didn't know how to actually get into the videos. So uh, when she got her first sports car, I figured it's a good time to introduce you guys, get acquainted, because uh, we're actually modifying the baloney shimoni out of her first sports car. Um, what did, what did you get exactly? <laughs> what did you get exactly? I got a 2011 135i. Okay, and why exactly did you want to get a 135i? Just for all, everyone watching, like, what, what, did I force you to get the 135? No, because your girl wanted a 1M, and she can't afford it. <laughs> so, I found this gem, and we're going to transform it into a 1M somehow. Some, okay, so some kind of 1M kit, which is what she wants to do. And all, I know a lot of you guys wanted me to do that with my first 135, and even Jonathan's 135. Uh, we didn't have the means nor the, 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 the love and passion for this car as we should have. So why exactly did you pick this 135, just out of curiosity? Because, come with me. <laughs> so when we saw these wheels on this car, it just looked super, super, super good. Uh, I believe these are the BMW original BBS wheels, and they're wrapped with Michelin Pilot Super Sport tires all the way around. There's barely, like, there's little to no curb rash on the front and rears. The big calipers also look really good. And again, there's Michelin Pilot Super Sports. They just look amazing. Um, correct me if I'm wrong, guys, but aren't these the two-piece BBSs? It looks like you can remove the screws. So I believe these are the two-piece BBSs. Let me know down below. But yeah, the first thing she liked was the wheels. What is, is there anything else you really liked about this car? I wanted a red interior. Red interior and? and I wanted a manual. Did you want a manual or I forced you into a manual? I want to learn. Okay. And I, what, what, there's no better way to learn than to have your own manual. And the only car I can drive basically. <laughs> so this is our first car, at least our first sports car here. We got her an M Sport uh, 135i manual gearbox. This thing looks absolutely insane. I believe this is probably one of the most rarest specs, dream specs in my opinion. It has this CIC navigation. And since I said CIC, yes. Also, of course, guys, it is an M Sport. It is a 2011. The last 135 I had, guys, it was a N54. And this one is an N55, which is a lot more reliable. And uh, did you want an N54 or N55? I think you actually wanted an N54. 54. Yeah, she wanted an N54. She really wanted the power. But I honestly, <laughs> I was like, this, you can still get a good amount of power. You can get some really good sound to it. I don't know if you guys know. A 135 with any turboed engine is just absolutely like such a joy to drive. I've been driving this more than her. But then again, I mean, you're, you're learning stick little by little. In what, two days? Two days, yeah. But do you, you got something to say about my driving skills? I mean, it's really improved. <laughs> and it's good. It's, it, it's impressive. I mean, guys. Honestly, like when she was driving, uh, I think I taught her a few times, like I was driving and I was telling her how to do this and how to do that. And then we went out for a parking lot, like literally the same exact night that we got the car. I'm, I'm sorry guys, we didn't have this on video, but it was a long day. And uh, she basically, she, she barely stalled. I think she stalled like once or twice, right? The first day? Twice. Twice. Today, when we took her on public roads, oh my God, I was freaking yeah, out. she was freaking out. So she stalled a couple times on public roads, but that's that's normal. I mean, especially with the pressure of other people honking the horn and people were like, like not as so nice. It was the BMW drivers though. Where is it? They have zero patience. Yeah, they really don't. <laughs> <laughs> so anywho, she wanted to learn stick and I was like, honestly, the best way to learn stick is by buying a stick and having no other choice than to drive one. And then we have the N55 platform, so I've never actually done an e-chassis N55 build on this channel. So we're definitely gonna have to fully build this for her. I think it's gonna be really, really, really dope. And in terms of aesthetics, uh, we're not gonna tell you guys the exact color she's going with, but it's not a color that I ever thought I'll ever go with. So um, that's gonna be kind of cool. Should I tell them I'm gonna name it? Uh, I already named it, didn't you? Well, the current name is Toothless. The current name is Toothless, and I mean, if you guys don't know who Toothless is, <laughs> picture right there. But yeah, guys, that that is her first car in the chin. I'm very, very, very excited to build this thing. I'm like, honestly, it is such a dream spec. When we found this thing, we're like, that's an unbelievable spec. We honestly found another one at the auction, and that is a long story, and that might even be, uh, you know, something we'll bring up probably in the next video. But um, we ended up putting our eyes and our money on this one because it is just such a 
gem. So I also wanna ask my girl one more question for you guys, and I bet you guys have this question as well. Um, did I peer pressure you to get a BMW? Or, uh, I mean, like, I mean, like, you know, I guess I only do BMW stuff, so, like, why did, why did you choose a BMW? Like, why not a Z or something else, or maybe an Infiniti G35? <laughs> this is behind the scenes, guys, but she's like, she couldn't answer the question. Are you good? I'm good. Okay, okay. Uh, because they love BMWs, and once you drive a BMW, you can't go wrong. <laughs> unless, unless. Unless. <laughs> unless you get your 7 Series. <laughs> <laughs> Which is an absolute hoopty. But, um, but as for that, I think we want to get some rolling clips to start up, like, y y cool, showing all that bit. Is not bad. We definitely need to put an exhaust on here. Might have to reach out to Vaptronic or might even just start with a muffle delete, honestly. I mean, that's not going to be too bad for her. I don't want something too crazy, but a Vaptronic, I mean, obviously having that luxury of turning things on and off would be pretty ideal. But for now, uh, babe, is it cool if we show them some drive by clips? Yeah, we can do that. Yeah? All right, cool, cool. <laughs> hey guys, that was our first shot and she didn't stall, so. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, that's not bad. Okay, I guess she's gonna try to put it in reverse right now. She needs two hands to try to put it in reverse because it's kind of kind of heavy, but yeah, it's good. It jumped. It jumped? And it terrified me. <laughs> put it in reverse, put it in reverse. I, I can't do that, it's heavy. <laughs> Just try, try, use two hands, two hands. Guys, this car looks so good. I absolutely love these wheels. Why would they put the tire shine on the tires? Shout out to you, I never thought like tires shine that much. Okay. All right, look at that, guys. Not bad. Honestly, guys, I'm very impressed at how quick of a learner she is. Like, I remember me teaching Jonathan, not bashing on Jonathan, but I think he stalled the 350Z like 10 times on the first go. So, uh, not bad. <laughs> Roll down the window. Second. the video this is the next day i'm pretty much doing the outro now my girl is holding the camera but we're gonna be filming a lot of videos together and hopefully modifying uh toothless right that's, the, that's what you named her yep so i think it's a her it's toothless it is an n55 you know i guess the masculine version is n54 i guess i guess you is know? it i don't know is it the masculine because you know, i don't know any <laughs> huh? who said it's a her oh it's a him mm -hmm. oh toothless is a dude it's a dragon. It's a dragon. Okay. Anyhow, this is getting a little weird for the channel, for the boys. <laughs> Hopefully, in an upcoming video, guys, we'll be modifying the living baloney out of this car. I'm going to be calling Burger Tuning. I'm going to be calling a few other companies and trying to make this car look really good and at the same time, also do some uh, sick sounds to it. I have a lot of plans for it. Actually, not really my plans exactly. It might be my girl's plans because it is her car. But anywho, she does have a lot of plans for the car. We're definitely going to try to make it happen on this channel. So, if you guys are excited to see a 135 manual N55, save the manuals, make sure to smash that like button. And then also, I might be picking up another manual in the next video as well. I, I, I don't know what's going on with him. I'm kind of going on a little bit of addiction spree, but I mean, that's BMW's there for you guys. So, if you guys are excited to see also the new next build, make sure to smash the like button. Without further ado, guys, I love y'all so much. Remember to stay on boss. See you guys in the next one. Peace out.